Reverend John Holier was brought up at Eton College, and in process of time became curate of Babram, three miles from Cambridge, and went afterward to Lynn, where opposing the superstition of the Papists, he was carried before Dr. Thrillby, Bishop of Eli, and sent to Cambridge Castle. Here he lay for a time, and was then sent to Tolbooth Prison, where after three months he was brought to St. Mary's Church, and condemned by Dr. Fuller. On Monday, Thursday, he was brought to the stake. While undressing, he told the people to bear witness that he was about to suffer in a just cause, and exhorted them to believe that there was no other rock than Jesus Christ to build upon. A priest named Boys then desired the mayor to silence him. After praying, he went meekly to the stake, and being bound with a chain, and placed in a pitch barrel. Fire was applied to the reeds and wood, but the wind drove the fire directly to his back, which caused him under the severe agony to pray the more fervently. His friends directed the executioner to fire the pile to windward of his face, which was immediately done. A quantity of books were now thrown into the fire, one of which, the communion service, he caught, opened it, and joyfully continued to read it until the fire and smoke deprived him of sight. Then, even in earnest prayer, he pressed the book to his heart, thanking God for bestowing on him in his last moments this precious gift. The day being hot, the fire burnt fiercely, and at a time when the spectators supposed he was no more, he suddenly exclaimed, Lord Jesus, receive my spirit, and meekly resigned his life. Hey everyone, this is R.A. Miller. I hope you liked the video. If so, consider supporting us on Patreon. Anyway, thanks for watching.